All right, y'all, welcome back. What we're gonna tie is one of my favorite dry fly patterns. This is a little black cricket. Uh, I tie this in brown and black, uh, super easy fly. The body for this is gonna be made out of black two millimeter foam. You'll use this for the underbody and the shell back. For the legs, I've tied knots into some black CDC. For our telling materials, black goose by it for the eyes this is optional you can use them you don't have to uh, black mono eyes in small and for our hackle this is pre-gauged out uh, dry fly in black thread that we're tying with today this is an ultra thread 70 denier in black hook that we're tying on tonight is a u203 it's a size 3 xl a uh, little bit longer hook it's just a hook that I always tie it on. I, you can tie this down even smaller. Uh, this is normally where I keep it though. Got two pieces of foam. I have one that's cut about an eighth of an inch and one about a quarter of an inch. You're gonna start with your quarter of an inch piece. We're gonna taper that end out. This just gives you a little easier tie in place. It's also gonna help split that tail at the back side come in pinch and loop check it run it up and then back down just about to the hook point that's going to be our tying points for our uh, tail like the two black goose bites i'll tie these in together i'm going to get them kind of even if you're not comfortable tying them in together we can tie them in individual. It's gonna go shiny side to shiny side. It's gonna be uh, just about a hook shank in length. Until you get comfortable tying in doubles, you can tie them in one at a time, and it'll be just fine. And we're gonna pull those back, take a couple wraps in tight, Take a look at it. If it don't sit right, take one more. Then we're gonna figure eight them. It's just gonna help secure those in. Like so. And we're gonna come in with our uh, one eighth black foam we're gonna clean that up cut it down into a point as well now when you wrap the body you don't want super tight wraps so you're gonna want this to build a little bit of bulk we're gonna come up to the two-thirds mark touch and turns Gonna catch that ain't across the bottom. Take a look at it. Looks pretty good. That's where I'm gonna come in and tie my legs in. in with our legs and tie these in uh, this is just gonna give it profile when it sets on the surface film not gonna do a whole lot for the fly and it looks pretty nice when you do it this way come in clean this extra out come in with our other leg yeah I'm kind of even Take a look at it, lock them, pinch them tight, tie them off. Now at this point, we're gonna pull the shell back over. We're gonna catch that in right where we tied our legs in. 
Now we're gonna stretch this forward just a little bit. We're gonna use the shell back to build up a little bit across the front there. That's where we're gonna come in with our eyes. Like I said, this, this step is optional. You don't have to use it if you don't want to. I like the way it looks. So I always tie it in. Figure eight them. Make sure they're set the way you want them. Now we're gonna come in with our dry fly hackle. One catch in the front, one in the back, another one in the front, and one in the back. Set that, pull it out. That's what happens when you don't cut your little Christmas tree in the front of it. You'll pull it out every time. Try that again. One complete wrap. We're gonna start working our way back. And we're gonna come back through. Try not to catch any of the hackle. We're gonna catch that in across the top. And come in and clean this up. And we take our time thread work it back through that hackle. It's gonna help secure it. We're gonna fold this back over one more time. Loose wrap, look at it, pull it down and set it. Come in and clean that out. Don't worry about that if you trap some of those, it ain't gonna hurt anything. Come in with the whip. Now, if you have a hard time seeing these darker bugs on the water you could put a speck of orange or yellow foam right there on the top if you wanted to you don't have to uh, I know I'm getting about to the point in my life where I'm going to start doing that and that's it that's a little black cricket hope you guys enjoy it uh, don't forget to like share and subscribe go check us out on Instagram Facebook and Twitter uh, stay tuned for more details about the drawing we got coming up in February like I said before, if you want to be enrolled, you have to subscribe to the channel. If there's anything you guys want to see, in the, just leave it in the comments below. And hopefully you enjoy the fly. Show it to your friends. And until next time.